Building a dual lock home with Metricon is all about realising the potential in your property. And in this series, we're following the journey of real life customers, Shane and Bridget Yole. In this first episode, Shane and Bridget are going to sit down with a development consultant, look at their property and discover some of the potential. So let's see how they got on in the first step of their dual lock journey. Hi, we're Bridget and Shane Yole and this is our third build with Metricon. We built our first home, um, family home with Metricon. That, that process was seamless and carefree that we decided to do actually start dual lock development. So we're on to our second um, dual lock development now. Today we're here to meet with our sales consultant about our initial site assessment. My name's Anthony Pisani. I'm a dual lock consultant and I work in the multi-unit space at Metricon. A lot of people think that dual lock is only two on a site and a side-by-side -side development. At Metricon, we certainly do more than side-by-side -side development. We also do more than two on a block. Metricon's great because of the seamless process. If you haven't had any experience with building dual lock, Metricon's got specialists that help them through the whole process. Today, we're meeting with Shane and Bridget, and I'll be going through their assessment with them on the site that they've bought. We'll decide on a house type, decide what works within council, and then work towards our preliminary contract. One of the things we're tr trying to achieve with this build is to get a four bedroom uh, home approved by council, um, which will lead to a better financial result for us in the end. All right, here we are again, hey? So give me a bit of feedback. What are you guys trying to achieve? With the last build, we only sort of got three bedrooms from council. What can we do to try to ensure that we get four bedrooms this time with that one? And I think we've got the real opportunity here with that to extend out there yeah. and also extend out the back as well too. Oh, that'd be great. And then at the end of the day, you know, we're not going to live in these, so I'm actually happy to give council what they want to make it easy to get the process through. So if we yeah. can do that, because it's, um, you know, for us, it's just getting it through council, get them to option the other side. Anthony seemed very confident about the fourth bedroom, but the great thing was that he had um, options that we could consider if it didn't quite work out in our favour. It was great to get started again. And we're really looking forward to our second dual lock with Metricon. So Shane and Bridget have taken the important first step in their dual lock journey and realised the potential in their property. Tune into the next episode as they discuss pricing and go through the town planning process.